I think we're getting along. Like we're moving through. Um, and, the, and the update is it, nothing's changed. <laughs> Everything is still hard. Um, getting up sucks, but it sucks differently each day, you know, and you kind of deal with it that way. Um, all of us are getting our, our medical treatment and doing all that stuff. And, you know, and, and there's, there's folks right now that are still trying to figure out how am I going to do that. And that's when people ask, how are you doing? We're, we're getting along. We're not, we're not shot. We're, we're, our, thank God, uh, Joanne and Chip are, are, are both, you know, recovering well. Um, and and nothing, nothing to the point where, you know, they're in, in, a, in a threatening position anymore. Um, but holy crap, that's our whole Colorado family. Like, the people that I depend on, are, you're looking at her, my daughter, and then my two best friends, and all of us were there, right? So it's, it's a constant thing, and everyone has a bad day, but out of the six of us, one, one of us didn't make it, and the five remaining, each of us has different days for bad days. And those bad days are usually angry days, not sad days, because you're angry at the position you're in and the direction you're moving because somebody decided to change that for you on the 19th. The, the, the only solace I'm taking right now is that I know that I had the t I, it took me 10 years to manage my combat stuff, at least 10 years. And they suffered through it with me. Now they're on the other side, right? And I'm on their side, but I'm also on the other side. So we're all in this as, as if we, were, we all just came back to war. And everyone in there in the club was the same way. And so PTSD doesn't happen overnight. It doesn't happen you know, the next day. Yeah, you have nightmares, but it's when it's five years from now and you get mad that somebody left a light switch on and you're just raging out. You don't understand why you're so mad. Well, you're mad because right now you're at that light switch. And had that not happened before, maybe I wouldn't have been at that light switch. Everything after becomes a reason to be angry because you're on a different path now. And it has to do with you dealing with how did I come to grips with this happened to me and now I, I am on a path that I need to be on, not a path that I'm forced to be on. And that's why people stay angry. I think it's just leaning on each other, really. Yeah. I mean, and, and kind of just, it's hard because all three of us did go through it and, and all three of us are in a household. And so kind of learning to be patient with one another again in a different way it is, is um, you know, it, it's challenging, but it's also like, I, I can resonate with what you're feeling right now. And I can respect what you're feeling right now. You know, it's not about what just happened or it's not about me. It's you're going through your feelings. You're going through your emotions. This is your journey, you know? And, and um, I think that that's huge because I mean, this is the kind of stuff that breaks up families, you know? And so that's very scary to think about too. Now it's a little fresh right now, you know, and, and I'm trying to get back to that spot, but I also need to kind of understand that everything needs to be at everyone's own pace, you know, and, and this is my pace for now. Um, and, and I know that the community respects that because whenever I do come out here, you know, the, everyone's just, honestly, everyone's like this. As soon as we come out, everyone just wants to give us hugs and you I'm know, blown a away. lot of love. I am so blown away by this community. And I'm not just talking about, I'm talking about everybody. Mm -hmm. it, it was amazing to see the line out the door I tried to shake everybody's hand. You were, I mean, you saw me. I, I'm, I'm just blown away. I, you know, you, you hope that your town would be like that, you know? I don't, I mean, it happens in Denver, I don't know if this would, it's too big. This place, I mean, everybody in some way was affected by this. You know, it, it's not gonna go away in a year. It's not gonna go in two years. I mean, this is a lifelong change, you know? And so it's important for us to um, be able to do what we can because we are survivors. Um, from that incident and, and you know, however we can help, we want to make sure to do that.